Oh. Am I scared? Am I scared? Yes. Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sam Scott Thorne and I am a vocal coach based in Glasgow. Now, if you'd like to meet and explore your voice a little more, then you can find me on www.sstvocals.com. You can also find me on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter and I will put the handles down below and over there. So today we are going to be listening to Nightwish. Now, I recently done a video on Ginger, which just about blew my head off. <laughs> um, it was pretty insane. And the reaction from that has been to listen to um, Nightwish. Specifically, this one suggestion keeps coming up and it's um, Ghost Love Score um, at the Wacken Open Air concert, which was in 2013. So we are just going to go right in and have a wee listen. I don't know what to expect. I've never heard this band before. Um, the only thing that I know is that it's been suggested pretty consistently from fans of Ginger. So I'm imagining it's going to be on the kind of rockier side of things. But meh, let's find out. Who knows? Who knows? Could be totally wrong. <gasps> Am I scared? Am I scared? Yes. Okay, so this is Nightwish doing Ghost Love Score at Wacken Open Air 2013. Kind of grand. It's like a like a musical score. Oh, it's it's called a score. This band are tight. I'm loving it so far and there's not even any vocals. <laughs> Here she comes. Wow. Okay, just before we go into the second verse, I think, I mean, this is a score, so it could go here, there, and everywhere, um, but I was not expecting her to sound like this. Uh, it's kind of thrown me a little bit. She has got an absolutely beautiful voice. It's like angelic, almost. Um, I like the fact that it's so the, the juxtaposition between her and the band is it's wild but it's also very well blended like she fits into that space so well and um, there's a very very clean operatic kind of sound to her voice that, that kind of thing she's got a lovely vibrato that i didn't have there but um you yeah, can't have all <laughs> it, it's, it's just i'm just enjo i'm enjoying it trying to kind of just balance the two things in my head Weirdly enough, like the staging as well, I quite like because everything around her seems to be kind of red and orange, and she's kind of this like almost like glowy purpley blue color. Um, 
I don't know if that's intentional or not, but I just it adds to the kind of duality of what's going on here. So let's keep going. Makes me flutter there as well. Mm. Great technique. He's kind of giving me the gooseies. That's goosebumps for anyone that's not Scottish. Silent from the deep came to me and sang my name, my love. Still I write my songs about the dream of life. He's kind of mirroring what she was doing vocally with the guitar. Switch a bit here. Nice. Um, just before we move into the next part here, oh, this is quite a long video. What was it? 10 minutes long. Okay, so I also love how wide she opens her mouth when she hits big notes um, or higher notes. Uh, getting that kind of space in there is quite important sometimes when you're trying to hit a note um, nice and big and resonant. Ah! You kind of sometimes need to open that mouth as wide as it'll go. She has quite a large mouth. I mean, I don't mean like she's got a big mouth, but... Um, She's, she's, she's got a big mouth, um, but in singing terms, that's, that's a good thing. So let's just keep going. This is so cool, it's like something out of the Avengers or Lord of the Rings or like, I mean, it's a score but it's a really good score. kind of choral element in there as well. Mm. 
She's so good at supporting Nora. Yes! Sounds a little bit like that um, scene in Home Alone where he's getting the house prepped. Wow. Yes! <laughs> yes! I am so into this. Why have I never heard of these people? <laughs> yes! Keep it going. <laughs> wow, that was insane! Oh, that was so good. Um, okay, so first of all, why have I never heard of Nightwish? Um, this is a travesty. I demand to know why no one told me. Well, you tried. You tried, and you did, so thank you. Um, this lady's voice, I don't know her name, but she's in... Incredible, I just said incredible again. Um, to me, the one thing that stood out more than anything through that whole video was support. She had so much support in her body. Like she was stood so statuesque most of the time. Even the way she was like whipping around, it still looked like, I don't know, she, she almost looks really like, big like Amazonian I don't know how tall she is or if, if if she's just quite tall and they're all quite small but she looks 
like a lot, a lot taller than them. Maybe she's not. Maybe I'm just like I'm just seeing it through uh, rose tinted glasses, and I'm just like, she's massive because she can sing big. I don't know. I'm talking nonsense. Anyway, um, her voice goes into such interesting places, um, with regards to to tone. So she has this kind of operatic kind of um round resonance through quite a lot of her vocals, and then she also has this kind of um, kind of like a like a pleading kind of mixy shout, um, not too dissimilar from kind of like a rock pop style, um, and then she has this like cool kind of wow kind of like scream at the top end of her voice. Um, I I'm not hugely accustomed to to this kind of music but what i do know is from what i've heard of lots of different kind of bands in this style is that it's kind of like a blending of of styles like there's always like a lot of kind of operatic stuff going on i don't think people quite appreciate the musicality that goes into music like this like in in the mainstream i, I think people that love this music are bang on with um you know how into it they are like how could you not be i feel like i wanted to like jump on the back of a horse and go to battle or something like it just had this kind of like i was getting more and more like riled up it was amazing um i i want to hear some more i think i think that's the the basic be all and end all of this is that i i want to hear some more um because her voice is just incredible but yeah like like i said the support was absolutely incredible she had to go all of her anchors like completely engaged her back anchors and her neck anchors it almost looked like she was like just like bracing herself from the force of like something on the outside but it was actually what was from the inside coming out she was really really engaged with it and i'm just super impressed so impressed that i'm just talking absolute crazy talk i'm just a blah, 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 blah. so nightwish thank you so much for suggesting this because I probably never would have heard them otherwise and it was just an experience <laughs> an absolute experience so if you liked that reaction then please give it a like and a thumbs up down below um, and if you have any other suggestions then let me know because this is quite an interesting journey that you are taking me on now and I'm I'm, I'm into it I'm into it let's do some more um, if you if you want to see more videos from me then please uh, subscribe to my channel um, ring the bell for notifications and when I release stuff you will be the first to know um, so all that's left for me to say is thank you so much for joining me and I don't know how to do this epic bye but no mm. bye. that was rubbish but I don't know what to do because my mind's gonna be blown so I'm just gonna go bye